All right, I thought this would be a good way to actually allow me to put a video into this uh, thread I just made to actually prove my point. So, first part of this video. My tablet here is charging. I mean, not charging, my tablet here is updating. Well, technically it is charging too, but um, it's updating. When I, plug, when I plug this thing into the wall to start doing this update, the battery goes at 94, 94%. When this thing is done, which seems to be very soon, the about the actual char instead the bat instead of the charge rate actually being uh, either increasing to like a hundred percent or whatnot the actual battery charge rate would be down to like maybe 50 40 30 percent maybe even a little less god forbid it'll be at 20 percent and this will prove my point because no matter no matter how much you actually have this computer plugged in and you're doing anything instead of it actually gaining a charge it will lose a charge so I'll come back and we'll see what my, see what my battery percentage is either way this is going this is going to really prove my point all right so actually I probably could have kept the uh, video going but I didn't want to make this video any longer than I need to all right so my computer is now done doing its updates Remember, I had the battery charged at the battery percent charged at 94%. So let's see what the battery charge rate is at now. 47. So it's not as bad as I thought it would be, as, as I thought it would be, but this is still pretty bad. Because a normal laptop like my Acer 2M1, when I plug that thing into the wall, if when its battery is getting low and whatnot, it will actually charge up correctly and the only key difference is that thing only that the uh, wall charger for that thing which I actually can bring up right here Give me a second. which is this guy right here which is, give me a second. which is this right here the uh, output rate is at 16 volts but and at 2.1 amps so the only difference is, other than the voltages, the actual amperage output of the, of both of the uh, of the two bricks are practically the same. The power brick that this that this originally came with, which is this right here, only charges at two only charges at two amps. This thing only charges at 100 milli, milliamps more. So so technically, this little guy right here should be capable of charging this thing. Just fine why it's why it's uh, doing eight why it's doing updates and whatnot, but that's not the case. But um, now be but now I can actually really get into uh, what I want what I what, what I want how I really want to explain this. But basically, okay, so let let me let's see. Do I have it on here still? Oh, okay, so I got installed again. Okay. So let's say okay. So let me give you so let me give you guys a scenario to help to really explain what I'm talking about. So let's say I'm playing Niku Pyra on my tablet here. I'm playing through the through the virtual novel and whatnot, and then I then I eventually encounter the low battery warning and I gotta plug it in. So I go do that, and and, and unfortunately, even though it's plugged into the wall. It will not gain a charge. It will lose a charge, just as you saw with me doing this update. I wasn't capable of showing the actual battery percentage because it didn't because this video did not come to me until I was far into the video, so I can't really prove that this thing was at 94%. You just gotta take my word for it. But then, of course, and whatnot. But on this explanation, really show will explain what I'm talking about. So let me restart all over again. So let's say I'm playing Niku Pyra. I get the uh, low battery warning, and I go to plug the thing in. And instead, of, instead of the internal battery on this thing actually gaining a charge, it'll actually lose a charge. So even though the thing's in the wall and the battery is supposedly charging, after around maybe another hour, hour and a half, maybe two hours, the tablet will just shut down. I cannot turn it on. I can't do anything. I'll have to leave it on the I'll have to leave it alone and let it fully charge up for around four hours or so. But that's not the case with my Acer 2 in 1 or any of my other laptops in my house. The only thing, the only computers that do this 
are the light are the little tablet or the little windows tablets that charge through micro usb and it's the same thing for my for my father's tablet too which currently uh, which currently he's letting me use but i'm going to be giving it back to him this right here is an rca tablet it's the exact same it ha the same thing happens with this thing too if I, pull, if, I, if, I, if I get a little battery warning and I still want to continue doing what I was doing, I, ha I can't do that. I have to quit doing what I'm doing and I have to let this thing fully charge up. Which basically goes into the uh, what wall charger should I, use, should I uh, buy to where I can efficiently charge this thing up without actually blowing up the actual motherboard on this thing. And before I end this video, I actually want to show the charge that I'm actually using to charge this thing. This right here is the charger I'm using. This is a Walmart, I mean not Walmart, this is the Best Buy charger, alright? The output for this guy, give me a second. I don't know if you can really see that. Output, 5 volts at 2.4 amps. So this thing's charging at 400 extra milliamps more than the uh, the no charger that this thing originally came with. But not even this charger here is capable of keeping is capable of keeping the battery at a con at a constant charge rate. It dips it'll, as you clearly saw even with this well, even with this more powerful wall charger, the battery or the actual battery charge rate will still dip. During like simple procedures like a uh, like a Windows update, streaming YouTube videos, stuff like that. So hopefully someone can actually point me to a proper wall charger that I can use on this thing to actually charge it up like a normal laptop. And of course, if anyone actually has laptops, little tablets like these and like these before, they know exactly what I'm talking about in the complete annoyance and how much of a pain in the butt these things are when it comes to charging them up. 